and we are the proud parents of Gidget Clayton. This is Gidget. And let me tell you something, when we took her to Chris, she was just five months old, barely, and uh, we called her a Mexican jumping bee. She just would not sit still, not for anything, not for anybody. I couldn't sit with her like this in my lap. Oh my goodness, it was miserable, it was very hard. She was not potty trained. Um, she was at least trained. She would run out the door if someone opened the door. And now that she is a graduate, I see it. Now she's a graduate of the Asheville Dog Academy, and she's she's a very very good girl. Come here, smile and say hi. <laughs> smile, say hi. Yeah. Say hi. And Violet, by the way, Chris's uh, wife is such a wonderful dog, loving, fabulous woman taught me some new organic recipes for my dog and taught me the proper health care for my dog also. It's just a fabulous facility and I highly recommend it. And know my husband. My wife says, I'm next. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he gets to go next. No, we're just thrilled with the work that uh, Chris did and, and uh, of course Violet with, with her help, I'm sure. But. Uh, the dog is just, you know, what we'd expect. We got a small puppy, and she was a puppy, and she was uh, wild and rambunctious. And uh, now she is uh, well-mannered and well-behaved, and we've got to do some more work to learn how to uh, take the techniques that uh, Chris has taught her and us uh, to hopefully see her mature into a more and more loving and, and uh, well-behaved puppy. We're excited. Well-behaved dog, yeah. and uh, we're just we're thrilled that... Uh, we get a lot of the learning curve out of the way. We're very excited. We can't say enough about Chris and Violet. Yeah, one thing that I did want to mention is that we talked to a lot of different dog trainers and uh, and interviewed and we called a lot of different people. But we knew once we had the chance to uh, go over and visit with Chris and his wife Violet at their uh, training area and their home and that uh, this was the right group of people for us to to turn our puppy over to. Uh, because we could tell that they loved the animals, they were good people, and uh, certainly had a great facility for training dogs, and that meant all the difference in the world to us. Huge difference, that they welcome people to, it's like checking your daughter or son into preschool. You want to meet the teacher, you want to go see where they're going to spend the day and the night, especially if you did what we did is the over three-week training, which is, I totally believe, incredibly worth it. So you want to see where is my baby going to be all this time, you know? Who's going to be giving that baby love and taking care of that baby? And it took a huge weight off of my mind when we were able to go and see where Gidget was going to live and be loved and trained. And um, the fact that they could teach her, you know, with love and kindness and discipline, which our youth really need, um, I think is a wonderful, wonderful thing. So I highly recommend it. And then also, if you have special needs, like, and I say special needs, like we travel. So for, for me, I needed to use this little thing to take our dog to the airport and this and that. And Chris will work with you, you know, what teach your dog the special needs. You know, I think that's important. Um, and nothing that they do hurts your dog. So I'm, I'm now my official little trainee of their techniques. And I'll tell you, like she is not hurt. She pays good attention. She's very well loved. And obviously she loves her belly rub. Anyway, we highly, highly recommend the facility. Highly recommend. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you very much. We love you, we love you too.